Hey, welcome back to Zamora Models. Happy 2018, everyone. Wanted to start the first video of the year this year with uh, what I plan to do with the channel and kind of my goals with the channel. Uh, this is the second calendar year that I've been doing this. Uh, still have a lot of things that I want to change about how I'm presenting things. Um, one of which being having a script to go off of or a guideline for the product reviews that I do uh, and a whole bunch of other things I um, want to give a, a thanks to Aero Virtual Assistant Solutions who has been astronomically helping me with uh, setting up uh, ZamoraModels.com still under construction but it's going to be at a, a website that I do a lot of my commission builds through um, sharing a lot of work uh, in the community uh, viewers like yourself can send me some of your work that you don't mind having posted and help build a community uh, through the website and the internet um, bring everyone together uh, also uh, advertising uh, group builds which is something I'll come back to in a minute uh, she's also been helping me uh, with some social media I've got a Twitter page going and we're working on a Facebook page as well as um, uh, brain farting now a uh, cu couple other areas there that will hopefully bring everything all together um, so with the product reviews I've got a with the channel, I've got a couple kits on here. I just set them here because after this video, I'm going to go right into doing product reviews on what you see on the table here. Uh, so this year, I'm looking to uh, do a lot more work and dive into my ON30 dilapidated lumber and mining railroad. Uh, the track is all laid, tan laid track uh, by my really good friend, the late, uh, really good late friend. Um, starting scenery on that now. I've also got a bit uh, building that I've already started, uh, so I'm looking forward to getting that underway and having more up on the channel for that project. Also looking at finishing up my pizza cutter in scale layout. Uh, by my, I mean my stepson's. Uh, he's working pretty good on it. It's come a long way, but it's got some other progress that needs to happen with that. Um, got to get around to a lot of the, the train items that I have. I uh, had a video up of what's on my bench work, or bench work, my work bench. Uh, that had a lot of buildings in it, and after watching it a few times, I realized I didn't put a whole bunch of trains on there. So I do have a lot of train stuff that I'm doing. I have uh, some HO scale, Titchy group cars flat cars that I'm building. I'm building one specifically in a six car pack. The other five I'm gonna do a video on and that way you guys can see the car finished while we build it. Um, and a lot of, uh, I've got a lot of DCC and sound conversions. Uh, we're gonna be building the Union Station uh, California commuter cars. Uh, those cars I've been told are pretty difficult to build so we're going to see how that works out I did get a whole bunch of additional detail parts so I'll probably want to putting a video up on that of what else to get in addition to the car uh, but they do look like really nice cars so we'll see how that turns out um, definitely want to get the website going uh, zamoramodels.com um, I'd like to get a uh, a lot more um, followers, obviously that's the point of having the channel, and subscribers, but I'd like to get the channel to a point maybe towards the end of this year, beginning of next year, to be able to do some group builds, um, but we'll see kind of how that plays out, so if you guys have any feedback on that, and, and if that's something that you'd be interested in doing, uh, definitely give me your feedback and your in the comments, I will make a point to reply to uh, every comment um, and uh, let me know what type of builds that you guys want to do whether it's a building 
uh, whether it's uh, building a car, um, adding details to things. And I'm also going to be doing a video log uh, on the YouTube channel here, probably find a way to post it to the website as well. Um, I have just information about the hobby because the ultimate reason why I started this was to share the uh, artistic value that I see in the hobby uh, as well as the therapeutic value that I got from it um, with the community and those who might be interested in it and as well as bringing new modelers to the hobby. Um, when I first started the hobby, you could go out and buy an Atherm Blue Box, in Blue Box Engine for $25. And if you chose to detail it or not, that's entirely up to you. And now it, it, the market is slightly different. Uh, the market's the wrong verbiage. Uh, the way that the hobby sells products uh, is entirely different now. A lot of the stuff is ready to roll. You pull it out the box, put it on the track and it goes down the track or in the case of an engine you pull it out the box program it to whatever unit number you want and it's detailed up and ready to go um, so I definitely want to continue to uh, share with the community and, and attract more modelers to the to the community uh, so that's it for this video just wanted to give a quick little rundown of some of my goals that probably will be added to and taken away from over time but thank you for joining me on this journey and uh, hope to see you through the rest of the year and into next year